the world's royalty, super-rich, celebrities, corporations and governments are bracing for further revelations of their secretive financial affairs with the public access of the Panama Papers set for later this week. The International Consortium of Investigative Journalists, ISIG, plans to open more of the files to the public on Thursday morning in Australia, reports the Australian Financial Review. It is anticipated they will be accessible by using the Licorious graphic display. The Paradise Papers is a database of 13.4 million documents detailing the tax affairs of some of the wealthiest people and companies on the planet. Perhaps the biggest name to emerge from the list is the Queen. According to reports, around $20 million from the monarch's private fund was paid into funds in the Kaima Islands and Bermuda between 2004 and 2005. A small part of the cash was traced to a lender which has previously been criticised for ripping off poor customers. The Australian Taxation Office has begun analysing the data as part of a wider investigation into complex tax structures used by companies and individuals. Officials said last week they will continue to monitor further leaks from the Paradise Papers. We anticipate further data may be published by the ISIG and the ATO will continue to work closely with other tax administrations to share intelligence on advisors operating globally, the ATO's Deputy Commissioner International Mark Koza said in a statement. The majority of the data comes from papers leaked by Appleby, a Bermuda-based law firm specializing in offshore accounts. Nearly 100 media organizations were involved in sifting through the tranche of files, which were obtained by the German newspaper Sudjutsky Zeitung and shared with the ISIG. Much of the Neutrova files includes bank statements, emails and loan agreements from Appleby, a firm which helps clients set up in overseas jurisdictions with low or zero tax rates. Copyright 9 Digital Proprietary Limited 2017